3D printing might seem to change the canvas of our housings, but how about having a home made with dirt? Yes, the first ever printed home is made with dirt. But how can a house made of dirt be cleaner for our earth? Stay tuned to find out the truth about 3D printed homes as we will reveal the dirty secret. Welcome to Futured. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for everything on future technology. That being said, let's begin. As 3D printing technology has progressed and proven viable in a wide range of applications, it has opened up a world of possibilities. The use of 3D printing in the construction of houses is perhaps one of the most visible emerging possibilities. People can now purchase and live in 3D printed houses, a concept that has only lately become a reality. The first European occupants of a 3D printed house, a Dutch couple, moved into their Eindhoven home on April 30, 2021. These new 3D printing milestones are great to learn about, but questions regarding their usefulness arise. Are 3D printed houses safe to live in? Or, more specifically, how is a 3D printed home superior to a conventionally built home? Let's reveal the dirty secrets, which you may have never known before watching this video. 3D printed houses are said to be a safer option than conventionally constructed homes, one that is more durable and stronger than conventionally constructed houses. They're built to withstand natural disasters and extreme weather. Although no long-term safety standards for evaluating 3D printed buildings for residential use have been established as of yet, now I will discuss the safety of 3D printing houses. The developing world's population is not only increasing, but also urbanizing, resulting in a housing shortage. Roughly 40%, in some cases 75%, of the population of fast-growing cities is living in squatter settlements without essential utilities. According to Habitat for Humanity, consider Brazil's favelas and Africa's shanties. By manufacturing units with speedier construction, lower costs, and more durable materials, a new technology could help to reverse the trend of overcrowded, dangerous housing. 3D printed homes are what they're called. The Texas Military Department is building a barracks in Bastrop, Texas, using 3D technology. However, because of legal issues and the fact that it is a new technology, 3D construction has not yet become mainstream in the West. Rather, it is being seen as a solution to house the global poor by a number of groups, and it is experiencing early adoption in underdeveloped countries. Finding high-quality construction materials has been problematic since individuals began employing 3D printing technology to create homes. Traditional construction materials differ from 3D printer materials. A 3D printer can only use a limited number of materials today. Furthermore, the majority of printers require unique materials. This means that the raw material from one printer could not be compatible with another. In this area of digitization, many vocations have already been mechanized, and once fully implemented, 3D printing will have a significant impact on personnel and the housing industry. Demand for qualified construction workers will fall, putting their jobs in jeopardy. It will also put workers who provide construction equipment and materials out of work. Bangladesh's remittances are largely sourced from the Middle East, where Bangladeshi construction workers toil unceasing chevaliers. Working in construction does not necessitate much specific knowledge. To build a 3D printed home, though, you'll need specialized talents that most people lack. As a result, this technology will have a variety of applications. Winsun, a 3D Chinese printing architecture startup, made news in 2014 by 3D printing 10 usable homes in a single day. The same company later 3D printed a fully functional six-story apartment building. Winson claims to have built 15 residences in Jianning City as of 2020, all of which have showers, air conditioning, toilets, and insulation. Construction costs and time have both been reduced dramatically thanks to 3D printing. What about the safety precautions, though? According to the business, the structures are at least twice as sturdy as concrete structures, and the materials used are environmentally benign. Icon is another American startup that wants to use 3D printing to revolutionize home building. They are involved in a number of projects, one of which was successful in becoming America's first 3D printed home for sale. Icon says that its material is stronger and longer lasting than standard building materials for safety and durability, and that it creates safer, more robust dwellings that are engineered to survive flood, fire, wind, and other natural calamities. What exactly does this imply? Companies always declare that their product is the best. In this scenario, it might be premature to pass judgment. 3D printed houses are still a relatively new product that has yet to be proven. The functionality of the houses has yet to be completely tested, 
aside from their physical and aesthetic aspects. To fully evaluate 3D printed buildings, standard regulations must yet be established. What exactly is the purpose of 3D printing a house? When it comes to building houses, how alternative and advanced is 3D printing technology? The advantages of 3D printing over traditional techniques of construction are few but important. 3D printing is the preferable solution because of its speed, waste reduction, environmental sustainability, creative freedom, and less human error. Even when it comes to building houses, 3D printing has already demonstrated its zeal for making items faster. The time saved by switching from traditional building, which takes months to years, to 3D printing, which takes weeks to days, is enormous. The initiative by Windsun to print 10 houses in a single day is an excellent example of the speed with which 3D printing houses may be completed. Construction time is also reduced because there is no manual labor, which is sometimes extended owing to labor breaks, holidays, or unpleasant working circumstances. As an additive technique, 3D printing is already a leader in the reduction of unwanted materials. In terms of building, the 3D printer can only use the concrete ink mixture where it is required. This manner, hardly any material is wasted. Some 3D printed houses are created from environmentally beneficial elements like sand and construction debris. Read this post to find out more about how 3D printing may help the environment. Is 3D printing good for the environment? In addition to lowering carbon emissions, 3D printing dwellings instead of traditional construction lowers them. For example, during the 48-hour build of the Pervok project in the Czech Republic, carbon emissions were reduced by 20%. One of the most appealing features of 3D printing is that it allows you to create more complicated and elaborate designs. The Amy 3D printed building's unique geometry, for example, is something that traditional construction might not be able to achieve. Because the printer's flexibility allows it to make unique structures out of concrete, metal, or thermoplastic, this level of creative freedom in house construction is possible. When a machine replaces a human, the number of production errors falls dramatically. The 3D printer's automated, accurate production eliminates tired laborers, construction site injuries, human errors, and other issues. Investment in 3D printed homes is a recent initiative aimed at addressing housing shortages and providing refuge for the homeless. However, this investment is not without its own set of issues. The regulation of 3D printed structure is likely one of the most pressing issues. There are currently no construction rules or procedures in place that would allow 3D printed houses to be approved for residential use. Electrical, plumbing, structural integrity and public safety standards must be established by the government. It is difficult to make 3D printed houses feasible unless this is established. A shortage of professionals is another issue. Because 3D printing is still a relatively new technology in design, there are few architects and engineers who specialize in 3D printed residential structures. It takes some time to become acquainted with the design approach. The design process must be adjusted because traditional blueprints are incompatible with 3D printers. Another concern is the limited number of construction materials. 3D printed houses have so far been made of concrete and plastic. Wood and steel segments cannot currently be manufactured using the printer. However, this will most likely be addressed in the future. Traditional concrete structures are designed to last 100 years, yet they only last 50 to 60 years on average. However, because of inadequate upkeep and the materials utilized, some only endure 20 to 30 years. The concrete-based compositions used in 3D printed dwellings should survive for 50 to 60 years. If it is well-maintained and regularly occupied, the structure may last even longer. How long do 3D printed homes last was the title of our research. To answer any questions you might have about the materials used, durability, and lifespan. There are houses printed for temporary occupancy that are only meant to be used for a limited time. For example, Windsun constructed isolation cottages for people who were quarantined. Because these are intended for temporary use, they will not endure as long as a permanent residence. Wood combined with 3D printed concrete could shorten the house's lifespan. Because timber-framed houses typically endure 20 to 35 years, the wood components of the 3D printed house may undermine its structural integrity. There is not enough information to say that 3D printed dwellings are safe to live in permanently at this time. Regardless of what each firm promises, it is impossible to know for sure until uniform safety rules for 3D printed homes are developed and implemented. 3D printing, on the other hand, has come a long way and will continue to do so. 
It's been put to good use recently with 3D printed homes for the homeless, disaster relief initiatives, and simply as a cheaper, faster, and environmentally friendly alternative. Will you ever be the one to buy a 3D printed home? Let us know in the comment section and also make sure you are subscribed as we will be bringing more such videos. Thanks for watching till the end.